What's up, people? Just doing a quick video. This is the Boker Plus uh, Decade Edition Lockback Knife in Carbon Fiber. Um, I was basically looking just for a small little more traditional style knife. This one obviously has a little bit modern material on it, but a lockback and um, something for my fifth pocket to carry. So, uh, actually on IG I spotted uh, Blade HQ did something about Boker Carbon Fiber, so I actually looked, saw this online, and basically on this video I'm just trying to let you know if you're interested, um, basically that's not a piece of crap. It's a pretty decent little knife. Uh, specs on this are six and a half inches overall length. You got a 2.875 blade length. Uh, VG10 steel on this. Uh, it is made in China. Uh, I believe I said the blade's hollow ground. About uh, two and a half ounces overall. There's two and a half ounces is the weight on this. But um. It's pretty nice. I like it. The carbon fiber on here is really nice. It's real carbon fiber. You got seamless integration. There's no, you can't feel any, you know, <clears throat> difference between the materials. There's no gaps or anything like that. Centering on this is a little off. It does not rub, so it's a $60 knife that's made in China. I'm not worried about it. Uh, lock up. It's nice and solid. Uh, there's, you can get a little bit of side to side flex in this, but it's a small gentleman's fold. I'm not really worried about that. Up and down really kind of irritates me, but even on if it had up and down, I really wouldn't care, but it doesn't. But other than that, I think it's a decent little knife. Um, it came pretty sharp out of the box. Not that that matters. I'll sharpen it up anyway. And like I said, it's just a decent little knife. Obviously no pocket clip. Got a little lanyard hole. And it fits about perfectly in my fifth pocket. So, uh, just for a little size comparison, it's almost the exact same size open and close as a uh, Vic Farmer. And you got satin finish grind, and the flats are polished. But for 60 bucks, I don't think it's a bad little knife. So, if you're interested in one, I'd say pick it up. You really can't go wrong with it. It's a nice little blade. And on that note, I'm out.